hi everybody and welcome back to my channel guys grace interiors i just wanted to come on quickly tonight and share with you guys some items that i picked up from home goods today uh, i do have a few items that i picked up last week at pier one I'm still working on that bedroom, you guys, my master bedroom. And I know I promised to do a tour on last weekend, but I totally forgot that uh, it was going to be my daughter's uh, baby shower on that same weekend. And so I'm still trying to recover from that, if you guys know what I mean. And so uh, hopefully by Sunday evening, I'll be able to record and get that video uploaded uploaded of my master bedroom now i have three items here that i'm going to be sharing with you guys that i purchased from pier one and these i i purchased for my um, master bedroom and so i had mentioned in my last uh haul that i did from burlington's that uh i showed you guys a silver cheetah and i mentioned that i also had a bronze one that was uh, waiting for me at pier one to go pick up i ordered this one online and I just, for some reason, you guys, I am into these cheetahs and different animals and everything, statues. But isn't he something fierce? Look at that face. Look at that face. And so I really plan on putting him on top of some um, coffee table books uh, in my bedroom or maybe on my dresser. I haven't figured out what, what I'm going to do with him, but I know he's going to blend in well. And, uh, I'll go ahead and link that previous haul above. So that way you all can, uh, if you haven't had a chance to see that, uh, video, you can, um, go back and kind of get an idea of the decor palette and the different colors and textures and everything that I'll be using in my bedroom tour and see how nicely he's going to blend also. That vase back here, that's going in my bedroom that you all see right back here. And you all can, excuse me, y'all can kind of see how he's blending in right there with that vase. And so I am so excited about pulling this thing together this weekend, you guys. No way I could do it last weekend. And also uh, put together my daughter's baby shower. It was so draining, but it turned out so nicely. This is another. Oh, he was $39.99. And I picked up this gorgeous flower. I still had some uh, money left on that gift certificate, so I took advantage of it. Especially when I saw this baby right here. It's, this is a nice size, you guys. And this uh, flower here was $29.99 and so yeah so I picked this bad boy up right here so super gorgeous again on top of some uh, coffee table books and see how it's blending in as well with that vase back there so nicely and so uh one uh one more thing that I picked up and I'm not sure where I'm going to actually put this but I when I saw it what did I do with it? I had to have it. I got stuff laying all over the place, you guys. And when I get off of here tonight, I'm going to do a major cleanup in my home. Things are everywhere. And so, yeah, this vase, it has a rustic vibe to it. Y'all know I love rustic decor. And even with that picture back there, you guys, my angel picture, uh, a lot of you all are familiar with that picture from different tours that I have done of this room. It blends in so nicely. I love this uh piece here and could you imagine some florals in this that's $29.99 for this piece and it is so beautiful so beautiful look how pretty that is I love it love it love it okay now I'm moving on to home goods you guys y'all know I love smell good stuff I'm always picking up something that smells good oh when I saw these candles here you guys now this is it says charming for farmhouse and so that explains why i first was drawn to the look of this because it has like a rustic style but it's so super cute oh and this is by dw home and normally their candles are pretty good it has a, a wood wick so that's going to give a cozy feel and everything it was 9.99 and the scents in this is lemon and clementine and I normally do not like lemon scents that much. So you can't really smell a lot of lemon in this. However, this smells so good. It smells so good that I picked up two of these bad boys. Also from Home Goods, sticking with the smell good items. 
I picked up. I thought this was a reed diffuser, but what actually drew me to this, you guys, was this vintage flower. So this is a flower diffuser. And so what, what, what how this works is you simply put that little rope thing, I'll say it's a wick in here. It's an oil wick is what it is. It's kind of like in my oil lamps, they have the same type of wick. So that wick would go in there and then this would sit on top. But I liked it because I said, oh, this would be so cute. Again, on either a tray for tray decor on, on, the, uh, on the coffee table. So that's why I got that. And this right here, I already took it out of the box. It was $4.99. So super gorgeous. Now I did uh, a shop with me uh, uh, a couple of videos back. And I had mentioned some pillows that I was uh, looking at. And I think that was, as a matter of fact, I know it was, it was Home Goods. And it was these pillows right here. And I know I said I wasn't going to buy no more pillows, you guys. So I'm going to have to give up some in order to keep these. And so I, in that video, I had mentioned that I was still going to go with this color here because I was loving this color in the fall and I'm still loving this mustard yellow color. And so I am going to use this in my spring and summer uh, decor in my home. And they had the cutest little uh, bunny rabbit pillows and everything, but I didn't get them because I'm trying to stay away from uh, decorating uh, as far as different holidays go goes uh and i'm gearing towards decorating for the season so that way i don't have to switch out stuff too much but isn't that simply gorgeous you got the gray you got the uh beige which are my normal neutral colors that i use and then that pop of gold and i'm just going to pull out those mustard gold pillows that i use in my um fall tour and um i'm in my fall decor and i'm going to mix that in with these and so yeah i bought two of these and these were, where's the price on this? Y'all see it has the feather feels. Oh, there it is. These were $16.99. Y'all don't look at my little ugly hands. I took those nails off and my hands are so damaged. I'm going to let them breathe a little bit. Just kind of recover from being damaged from wearing those acrylics for so long. But yeah, isn't this so pretty? So pretty, super gorgeous. And so this next item is gonna be, um, I guess you could say organizational, an organizational item. I had been looking for something to actually house when I clean and I have the wet towels once I'm finished cleaning. And I wanted something to put those wet towels in where they would where they weren't sitting out and looking so messy and nasty in my laundry room. And so I thought these were so super cute, you guys. This is actually a garbage uh, can. And it says keep clean, as you can see there. It has plenty of space in it, you guys. And I thought this would be nice for when I clean up and I just put my wet cleaning rags in here. And then when I get ready to uh, wash them, I just simply just take the, the uh, inside pail out, dump it in my um, washing machine, and voila. So simple. And plus, it's going to look so neat in my laundry room. And that right here, I don't have to touch anything. Just step on there, drop the cleaning rag in there, and go forth when I'm ready to clean. And so I picked this one up. And it was only $19.99. Good price. I didn't want anything too big, and I definitely didn't want anything too small. And so I got two of those. This one has the black uh lining in it and so what i thought about i said um one of them has the gray lining and one of them has the black and so i, I thought about it and i said well they don't really have to match and that way i can uh, separate the two because this one is going to be for like my wet towels washcloths and everything and so they're going to go in here and the other one is going to house my cleaning towels. And then at the end of the night, I can just pull it out like this here. 
here again. Dump it in the washer and clean those up. So I really, really like these. I think they are so super cute. And they're going to match my laundry room perfectly. So they'll, those two are $19.99 each. And then when I saw this, y'all. Ooh, when I saw this, I knew I had to have it. Oh, it's heavy. Now, what I'm going to do with this, I don't know just yet. But I knew I had to have it. How pretty is this? And this thing is huge, you guys. You see the inside of that? It is something fierce, though. It's heavy. $69.99. And it's worth every penny. When I tell y'all this is good quality, heavy. Oh, I don't know if I, I know, I think I'm going to put some greenery in it. I know that. I'm going to use it as a vase. Now, am I, I, I was thinking about putting this on either my coffee table or on my entryway table. However, I could not leave the store without it. How super gorgeous is this piece? Y'all hongas have some nice, nice pieces. Oh. And when I tell y'all this is heavy, this is heavy. Oh, Lord have mercy. Okay, the last item that I want to share with you guys, I think it's the last item. That sure does seem like it went by fast, but I have been eyeballing these on um, different home tours and different ones when they do their shopping hauls and everything on Instagram as well as on YouTube. And I just, I was just like, man, I would love to have one of those. And I, every time I would go to Home Goods specifically for this item, and this has been probably, I know, about a year ago, I could never find it. But for some reason today, when I walked in, em almost immediately, I saw this bad boy right here. Now, let me get up. Y'all bear with me. Okay, Y'all, I'm back. But I got this big, oh, this is huge. This ginger jar is huge, you guys. So this one, and I'm finding all those ginger jars that I could not find before. Because again, in my last haul, I showed you guys a ginger jar that I had. This was $69.99. Again, well worth the price. And so here's the top to it. Very heavy decor pieces. Then I have a smaller one that goes to this and I purchased it off a line on Amazon and I believe if I'm not mistaken I don't know how much I paid for it but uh I know it was it was quite pricey and it's way smaller than this however it matches this so I am going to put the two together and uh, I'll show you all how they look together because I actually have the smaller one here. And I've had a number of different people ask me, where did I get the smaller one from? And I did purchase that on Amazon. And I'll put that in the description box so you all, if you would like to purchase one of those, you can. But this one here, this big boy, it came from Home Goods. And so I'm going to set this up, you guys. And, um show you guys what they look like hold on for one sec okay you guys so that's how the two look together the one on the left is the one i purchased from home goods the other one on the right the smaller one is the one that i purchased off of amazon and i'll link that below in the description box if you all are interested but those are so gorgeous i can't wait to uh decorate with those and these candles here you guys i'm sitting here and they are smelling so good i don't have them lit i don't know how they're gonna do um once i light them but just sitting here on cold i can smell them and they smell really strong and so at any rate my little video is all over the place you guys because i just wanted to come in and um show you guys the different pieces just in case you want to have uh you'll have time to go out and pick some things up if you would like because you know once you see something at home goods you have to jump on it right away because that stuff goes so fast but i just wanted to come on and share with you guys tonight the pieces that i picked up and I hope y'all are having a blessed Valentine's Day. Thank you so much for watching and tuning into my channel. I thank
thank God for my new subscribers, my old subscribers. I thank you guys for subscribing. Uh, also, feel free to leave a comment and also share and like this video. Also, follow me on Instagram if you like. I'll link that below my Instagram page. And you all be blessed. As I always say, stay blessed in the Lord. And until the next video, bye-bye.